Hey guys, it's 18 here, and I'm going to be talking about something that's been going on. It's kind of weird. The actual character, or, you know, scary thing, isn't exactly new apparently, but it's called Momo, and from what people have been saying, it's a scary kind of character with a really weird face. It's creepy. I'm going to show a picture of it in, like, a few seconds, so if you don't like scary things, I'm just warning you. It's not incredibly scary, it's just kind of creepy. But apparently on the YouTube Kids app, people have, like, parents have been reporting that, um, some creators have been, like, putting her in their videos. And essentially what Momo was, it kind of reminds me of a creepypasta, but apparently it's some sort of, like, morbid challenge where, like, the person who is taking the challenge, they want them to, like, do weird things and violent things to, like, them and other people. And... Yeah, it's not for kids at all. It's more of a- it reminds me of a creepypasta, if you know what that is. Essentially an internet scary story, or, you know, scenario, or ritual. But the ending of the challenge is supposed to go on for a month, and by the end, this, the person's supposed to kill themselves or something. It's kind of dark, but yeah, it's something kids definitely shouldn't be- It's definitely something kids should be staying away from and not, you know, being subjected to. And I just wanted to bring awareness if you're a parent or something like that. It's one of those things where parents should really be looking at what their kids are watching. I think that's the moral of the story. I'm not trying to attack anyone. I'm just saying like, parents should really like, look into what their kids are watching and don't let the YouTube kids app or the iPad be the parent, if that makes sense. Just cause there's an app which says everything's okay. It doesn't mean you shouldn't check it. But yeah, I thought I'd just report on um this weird Momo thing and yeah, I just don't really understand why, like, news groups are, like, reporting it now. Well, no, I do understand that they're kind of upset about it, and it shouldn't definitely not be on the YouTube Kids app. However, Momo's not really a new thing, and I think it really just comes down to parents being vigilant about what their kids are watching. And, yeah, it's just an interesting little story. And I noticed, well, I watched a couple of videos about it, and apparently it's been happening in the UK. And like it's just being re being reported on so yeah it's interesting but yeah moral of the story look at what your kids are watching and momo's just, look just looks weird so <laughs> i thought it'd be something interesting you guys would like anyway if you enjoyed this like mini news kind of video from my channel hit the like button and tell me other things you want me to talk about if you guys don't like this kind of side you know section of my videos tell me why don't just leave a dislike. Yeah, if you do like it though, comment on what you like about it. I just thought it'd be interesting to add some variety to my channel. It's not that I don't like Dragon Ball, I just think that um, if you guys like me as a YouTuber, it would be cool if I did like some different things. And I'm gonna be doing like different Dragon Ball videos and things like that. I'm gonna be doing like different types of Dragon Ball videos and things like that, like discussions and theories. So I thought I'd just add something else to the channel. So if you guys like it, just let me know. Give me feedback. That's the most important thing on YouTube. Like, no YouTube is perfect. And the only way people learn is through feedback. And I think people forget that YouTubers are just people. So I don't know if something's going to work until it fails or succeeds. So yeah, hit the like button if you enjoyed. Make sure to hit the subscribe button and the bell to receive notifications for whenever I upload a video but yeah i want to thank you guys because i recently hit 8,000 subscribers and yeah i'm just super happy about it thank you i never expected so many of you guys to like me so yeah thank you make sure to follow me on twitter and join my discord the links to those are in the description as well as my patreon link so if you guys want to fancy backing me on patreon then that would be awesome still waiting for youtube to monetize me so it would really help tide me over and, you know, let me know that you guys love me. But yeah, I really appreciate your support and I hope to see you guys back here soon. Anyway, I hope you have a nice day. And don't forget everyone, subscribe to me. Because I'm definitely 18.